Hey y'all, Irix guy here, and if you're like me, you were probably pondering, you know, should I buy the uh, the Carl Zeiss E mount 35 millimeter f 2.8 lens? Because you may have noticed that it has a, uh, and this is the lens hood right here that's on it. You may have noticed it has a kind of different lens hood, and I'll show you how this goes on and off. Um, so it's obviously the lens hood is on right now. It does have a lens cap but it's a somewhat proprietary type design, something different than, than one may be accustomed to. But to take the lens hood off, you simply twist, and then there's your lens. And much to my surprise, as you can see, I do have a UV filter attached. Check the link within this video's description. You can find the UV filter that I'm using, as well as this lens and some other uh, related equipment that I'm using. But yes, it does allow me to attach this lens filter, this UV filter, but still be able to use the lens hood. So that was something I was worried about. I didn't know if I was going to have to uh, to potentially purchase some sort of really weird... Because see right here, this is threaded in here. If you look real closely, uh, it's threaded in there where this attaches. So there's probably filters that would be able to fit into this, but that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to use a standard um, UV filter, and that's what I was able to do. So I can use that. UV filter's attached, but I can still use the lens hood if I choose to do so for certain, for certain uh, photo and or video situations. So I hope this video is of value. Is a big question I had before I purchased this lens. So, uh, if this, if you like this, be sure to to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and uh, and share with others too. I appreciate it. Uh, thanks for watching, and y'all have a good day. It's YouTube.com forward slash Irix. Yeah.